Good evening, lockdown Britain. How are you doing? Still coping? How's the hair looking? How's the personal grooming going? My hair's turned into Lego. My back hair is growing down into my bum cheeks to form a rhino horn cartilage of intimate body hair that I can't bear to look at. Homeschooling, just a distant memory, as now we shove monster munch into the screaming mouths of the little shits who just one month ago we lovingly explained who the Romans were. Screw the Romans. This is pickled onion flavour. That's Mr Tumble. Shut your mouth. I'm going to go and scream into a pillow in the bedroom. <laughs> it's time to sign. Yeah, thank you, Mr. Tumble. Look, Daddy's having a breakdown. Can you sign breakdown? <laughs> yes, Daddy's having a breakdown. <laughs> Listen, clapping for the NHS is an excellent thing. <laughs> clap for the NHS. Even give a chunky clap. <laughs> chunky clap with poignant head shake. Chunky clap, poignant head shake with point to neighbour opposite. But remember who we're clapping for. We are clapping for all the carers, all the key workers and all these amazing people keeping little shits like me alive whilst I'm locked down having to watch Netflix. Oh, the sacrifice. Let's not start making the clapping a bell end behaviour that's about you. And I'm seeing a lot of it. A lot of little videos, not of clapping, but what I call disclapping. Display clapping. Don't need to enhance it. You don't need to bring everyone out playing musical instruments. Dance a jig, son. You dance a jig while daddy claps. Clap for the NHS in time. Clap for the NHS. Get your sister out. There's a sister on tambourine. Oh, the Smiths. We clap for the NHS. Get fucking Nan on the bagpipes and Grandad playing the fucking spoons. It's all about us. Let's make a viral video of us clapping for the NHS. This is not your drama GCSE practical assessment. Lauren from Croydon. I would just love to express my gratitude for the NHS. Turn up my selfie ring light. Live stream. Oh my God, I'm crying. <laughs> just really thinking about all those dentists and dustmen and all the people that do all the dirty things. Hooray, well done dirty people. But worst of all, fireworks. Who is setting off fucking fireworks for the NHS? Are you insane? A, fireworks are really expensive. Why don't you just go and drop a tenner on Captain Tom? He's up to 30 million, the legend. And B, do you not see a slight contradiction in setting off a firework for the NHS? One of the quickest ways to get a bell end injury and get yourself sent to the emergency room to distract the nurses trying to defeat COVID-19. Well done, Bellend McGinty. Aaron, this is for the NHS. Light a rocket while I'm holding it. <laughs> Fucking excellent. Clap for the NHS. Oh no, I've now got a bloody stump due to the laws of evolution. I'm no longer going to exist as I've taken my own hand off and I'm going to bleed to death in casualty. Thanks, Charles Darwin. I'm out the food chain. Try to behave yourself at supermarkets, people. Everything's great outside. We've got the security guard. Then when we get in there, it's Bellend fucking city. Some people can't even follow the giant arrows on the floor. Are you okay? People that can't follow giant arrows on the floor. Do you need help? Do you need to attend the supermarket with some sort of social worker to help you get to the beans? Blue arrow goes forward, but I go backwards towards beans. Arrow forward, but Darren from Broxbourne goes backwards. Forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. You're either thick as shit or arrogant. Shut up, man. No one's telling me which way to go, it's fucking arrow. No one's telling me to go towards no fucking eggs on aisle 15. I'll go the other way to the arrow. No virus is gonna get me. I'm a G, you know. If the virus comes near me, get away. I defeat that. Virus doesn't even come in my postcode, it just goes past me. Dickheads. Also, you may not have realized this, but the people who work in supermarkets are human beings who can get COVID-19 too. The only reason I say you might not have realised this is, I see some of you social distancing outside the supermarkets, two metres apart, into the supermarkets, two metres apart. I'm even following the arrows. Oh, wait a minute. There's someone stacking shelves in a Tesco uniform. I'm just going to spit COVID juice on them. <laughs> Fucking Tesco worker. I'm going to pass within one millimetre of you. I'm going to enter you. <laughs> I'm inside you, you prick. <laughs> and out again. Two metres distance from the members of the public. Show some respect. And last, but by no means least, Zoom. Yes, we know you've downloaded Zoom, Auntie Carol. Well done, but here's a newsflash. So has 65 million other people in the UK. Every fucker's on Zoom. My wife's doing bingo on Zoom, for Christ's sake. How northern is that? All the fours, four 
Spotify. It's great that you're all having Zoom chats, seeing your family, grids of 9, 10, 15 people all joining in. But please, not everyone's as lucky as you. Not everyone's got 10, 15 people they're hanging out with on Zoom. So here's a little request from the 99.9% .9 of us that aren't bellend. Here's my nipple online. Please buy my protein powder. Get my flaps out for a like. Look at my flaps. Like my picture, my flaps are out. Here's a request from the rest of us. Don't show off how many Zoom friends you've got with a little screen grab with you doing a selfie. Here I am. Oh my God, here's all my Zoom friends in the background. Look, look, Uncle Dave has got a drink and he's toasting in the shop. Life's just as normal. Instead, why don't you just download some music software, get some beats, get a guitar and record a song you can believe in. This one. Look how many friends I've got. Please look at me. Look how many friends I've got, please look at me. I've got so many friends, I'm a socially successful car. Ha 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 I don't want to finish that swear word and ruin this video, so you'll have to finish it off yourself. Stay safe, people. Clap in a normal way. Don't let off fireworks with your hand. And if you've got Zoom friends, enjoy it without feeling the need to show off. See you soon. I'm going to exit downwards. Oh, wait a minute, I forgot something. Oh.